These next techniques are much quieter. If you've lowered your volume, you'll need to bring it back up to your normal picking volume. Also, return your tone setting to normal if you've cut the highs. Let's begin with a short demo. When bowing across the strings, with the ebo held directly over the hot spot, each string is amplified instantly as the ebo passes over. Cross quickly. Don't wait for one string to swell into sustain before moving on to the next. Each string sounds as loud as if you'd picked it. Now we have some fun. Hold the ebo away from the hot spot and sustain the open A string. Lock your right wrist into position, then glide up to the hot spot and bow back and forth from the A string to the D string and back using arm motion, not wrist motion. Keep wrist locked so the ebo stays aligned with the strings. Don't lift it from the strings or press too hard. It's important to hold the ebo over the hot spot when crossing strings quickly. It's too quiet to be heard otherwise. Don't wait for one string to sustain and start getting loud before moving on to the other. Moving the ebo back and forth between two strings requires a little larger movement than with picking. Keep this back and forth cross string bowing action constant and start fretting the D string. Voila, a cello like pedal tone. Okay, are you ready? Keep wrist locked with the ebow directly over the hot spot. Hold an A minor chord. Now move the ebow across the strings from the A string to the B string and back. Arpeggios! Use arm movement, not your wrist. For an even response, cross the strings in a straight line over the hot spot. An arpeggio from E to E requires more practice. Lift the ebow from the strings to stop cross string bowing. If your bass pickup is a double coil humbucking, cross string bow over the coil closest to the fretboard for a great cello sound. Bounce the ebow across the strings for a spiccato arpeggio. Mix them up. Create your own combinations. More fun than a human being should be allowed to have. For dynamic control when switching between Ebo techniques, remember to back away from the pickup for sustain. Get close for spiccato. And always stay over the hot spot for cross string bowing effects like pedal tone or arpeggios. For dynamic control of cross string bowing, apply various degrees of pressure on the e bow. The lighter you press, the softer the sound. The more pressure, the louder. It feels very natural. 